hello guys in the last video we have added the social network icon bar let's see here in the header section there is a menu and there is a simple logo but I want to fill up this empty space as well let's design a logo for this empty space let's check out the dimension what we will be required to okay if you can see the head is 1000 pixel wide to 196 in height okay so for making this we'll go to one website which is my favorite called cool text let's go to cool text graphic you can select any graphics you want this burning one is there animated I want to take any simple one this look good name of my channel is tech no sandy yeah it should look somewhat like this you can go in image you can add a logo layer but your text size is this I'm not sure if comp download this cut this close this again we'll go to image we will paste here and I'll say at is a, it is a I will save this as banner I'm not sure what is the dimension let's see the dimension is this 657 and 174 let's add this okay in the header section see in the container we have already added this will all uh, again will add one another image in that images it will be a uh, banner image <laughs> let's see the preview how it's looking no oh, it's looking cool isn't that isn't it looking cool what I can do I can go in CSS inside the head and there is ULLA right inside the container display inline block is there right let's say margin insert padding padding right 25 pixel control Z oh this is not this is working for container right we have to use this for container image whatever image we are adding see images are getting highlighted and what I will do is adding padding right I'll add this as 100 pixel yeah it's looking cool is coming exactly at the center let's make it 110 yeah it's looking more accurate if you refresh then you can see it's looking amazing now since we have done 
we will not keep the social icon bar empty this is a Facebook link so let's search Facebook just for reference I am giving just link for that okay so whenever he will be clicking on the image automatically it will redirect let's say Twitter Our third social network icon was YouTube. Guys, refresh. Now, see if you click on this, it's coming to the same, it's opening in the same tab. If you want to open it in the different tab, you have to add an attribute. What that attribute should be? the link in the anchor yeah it should be target and in the target we will put blank what target blank will do it will open the links in a new tab since it was not working we'll restart this and restart the demo every file will be loaded yeah if I click on this see it's going to the another tab new tab going to the Twitter I click on this YouTube it will click on YouTube so guys 50% not 50 70% of the work is already done now I will show you how to add your home about me resume school project contact me and all the other pages the base for all these pages is already done since it's seven minutes we can create three four minutes video more I'll show you how to do that how to create all the other pages now this content is common this social icon this total heading this total footer is common what the content will change is in the body body content for each page will change so what we will do in the home tab if we copy this let's see we'll name it as a home not html we'll name it as a about not html by default we will be creating these pages in the same directory okay resume dot html sch all school dot html project dot html contact dot html similarly for the footer link we will create the pages so 90% work is already done now if you try to click on this see it will say cannot get now copy this index.html copy and how many links are there in total close this okay close this 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 create 10 copies of this Control V, Control V, Control V, Control V. Four copies are created. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
this index is the main page home is the home about me resume so and rename these files home rename this as about then this is resume then school then project then we have contact similarly there is a page for help after that there is a page for feedback after that privacy then terms so congratulation guys you have actually completed this if you go in about remove this body text okay for just to show you i am creating these tags if you create on contact go to feedback if you are in help privacy projects and then there is a resume school then there is terms select all you can beautify this for every what you can say page you can beautify index we will not do anything 
help now guys we have created all the pages for our website now we'll click on the demo link now see every page is created like if you click on home the middle home page is loaded if you click about me it's about page is loaded resume resume is loaded school school is loaded and you can see we are navigated to that particular page project contact help send privacy term okay so guys we have completed our complete website from scratch let me summarize we have created a folder then inside the folder we have downloaded all the resources inside the resources we have added some extra resources later like for example we wanted to have this banner which we had not al already downloaded in our first video then after that we created all the pages and finally we have our working site what you need to do now is you can change the body content according to you and modify the same website and use it as a personal website so guys please like share and subscribe my videos your help and your support is only my motivation stay tuned for other technical videos i'll be updating all the videos as soon as possible so guys thanks bye let's meet in our next video